for 18 years, I was a public prosecutor, a deputy district attorney for San Diego County, California, where I investigated and prosecuted crimes. And that experience of uh, investigating and researching what really happened was critical training for my ability to put together the story behind Creating Christ. And I'm a novelist published by Random House and HarperCollins who writes science thrillers that have been translated into 18 languages around the world. Because these novels are based in science, I have experience in doing extensive research in my books that have prepared me for working on this particular book. I myself was raised a Christian and uh, as a child was deeply interested in Christianity of a devout Christian and developed a lot of background knowledge by reading both the Bible and secondary literature at a very early age. And if I can just say, initially even to us, even to ourselves, the thesis sounded kind of crazy. It sounded so unconventional, it sounded so counterintuitive that we questioned ourselves. We had made the discovery that there was a connection between the Jewish war of the first century and the emergence of Christianity could not simply have been accidentally occurring at the same time. I went from a conservative view of the Bible to kind of a mainstream critical view like my uh, pal Bart Ehrman has now. He's, he's very critical, he's not a believer anymore. And uh, to my great surprise, I eventually found myself accepting what I once considered extreme or even crazy views, but the more I actually examined their arguments, the more I felt, yeah, I've been missing out. Uh, these guys are right. Creating Christ, well, I think it must have been uh, in the 1990s, James. He called me up and he emailed me and had read my work and it influenced him somewhat, obviously. And then he put this other aspect of it together in his own unique way and it's uh, quite a convincing presentation. I became interested as an adult in religion after uh, I had, interestingly enough, I had a born-again experience, born-again Christian. And at the same time as that was occurring, I came across an individual who was very knowledgeable about re different religions. And so my interest was piqued in all religions. I had studied them in college. I had studied uh, Greek civilization. Christianity I had studied, and then when I discovered the mythology uh, within Christianity, I realized that almost nobody was talking about it, and it occurred to me that my background in archaeology, in classics, in Greek civilization, in the Greek language, and even dating back to when I was a child studying mythology was very relevant to this field of Christian mythology, too and bringing in the pagan parallels is one of my specialties. 